What's going on guys? My name is Howard and this is the one and only HTDG Gaming with the new series for the channel. If you guys don't know, this is Stardew Valley. It's kind of like Minecraft, but a little bit more real. Well, a lot more real. It's a simulator game. Uh, it's kind of like a farming simulator. It's, um, it's pretty cool. Uh, I saw the gameplay. I really liked it. I saw some reviews for it. I really um, liked the reviews too. So I decided to play it for you guys. Uh, I went ahead and dressed up my character. I kind of, I was going for a lumberjack look, but then I saw the little bender eyes and I was like, fuck it, he's going to be a cyborg. And uh, I gave him some pretty unique hair too. You know, just, just cause. So, uh, there's a cutscene coming up. I'm just going to turn off the mic. So, I, I, I don't really, the sound is too loud, so you won't even be able to hear me reading if I do decide to read. So, I'm just going to turn the mic off and um, let you guys in, enjoy the cutscene.
All right, guys, I'm back. I had to turn the sounds down just to, um, because they're really fucking loud. Um, when I first started recording, I couldn't even hear myself because they were that fucking loud. Uh, so, yeah, that's why I couldn't read the titles to you guys, which really sucks, but, uh, you know. All right, so we got 15 parchment seeds. We're going to start the farm, but first, let's check out this germ. Getting started. Cultivate and harvest a parsnip. Easier said than done. Introductions. We gotta go meet everybody. So we'll get around to that. But first, let's start gardening. Okay, the first step when you make your garden is you have to clear all this shit out. I mean, all of it. So, first, you gotta clear all these grass out. All the grass. Okay, step two. Use the pickaxe and remove all this rock. Alright, now you get your axe out, and you remove all these little stumps, all the little saplings, and all these big ass trees. And if you gaze your eyes over here, this is the energy bar. Now doing activities like chopping down trees uses energy, so you have to do a certain amount of work each day to use up the energy bar. If you don't, you kind of just waste it a day. But, uh, yeah. Okay. So let's throw out this grass a little bit more. And this a little bit more. Okay, so now that you've cleared out a space large enough for your garden, the next thing you want to do, that's not the hoe. <laughs> um, you take the hoe and you start cultivating the ground. By that, you make it good enough to use. Fucking hell. <laughs> you guys saw where the fucking mouse was. Why did it do it fucking all the way over there? But I'm gonna do a 10 by 3. I don't even know if that's 10 or not. Okay, let's, let's count. Alright, first grade counting skills. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, I'm a lucky bastard, I guess. Alright, so... You get clay for, um... When you cultivate the ground, you just, it just randomly generates. Uh, clay is good because um, you guys know Robin, the person from the beginning who sells the house upgrades. You need to give her um, building items when you uh, start. Mm -hmm. That way she can... Well, you have to pay for uh, house upgrades and you give her building items along with money to upgrade your house. So we'll be able to get new things in our house, um, like a kitchen, for example and some other stuff. I'm not going to spoil it for you guys because uh, that's a little dickhead part on my move. Move on my part. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, but now we're heading into town. Um, there's a shop. The shop owner's name is Pierre. We're going to go there and buy some some seeds um, to help with the garden. Here's everybody's birthday. Mary Lewis's, Vincent's, Haley's, Pam's, Shane's, Pierre's and Emily's. So let's get into the shop. Oh, cool! New people for us to meet. Uh, we just meet Gus and uh, Marie. All right, so Gus is the he owns the saloon. You go there, you can buy food and other stuff like that. So let's get 15 more parsnip seeds. Put those down. Okay. So now that we got the parsnip seeds. Uh, I'm not going to go back just yet, I kind of want to meet people, so let's go into town and meet everybody we can. See this is his saloon, let's go in here. It's locked. Oh, it opens at 12, so we'll come back, the time goes right really fast in this game. Let's head over, let's head over here, um, let's see what's over here. Here. Hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological, sorry if I butchered that, office. Uh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts to display. Then why are they paying you? Why are you there to display nothing? Anyways, but I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Yeah, so if 
uh, you find any like minerals or anything, you just give it to him and he puts it on display. I think he gives you stuff sometimes. Alright, let's go to the next place. Let's talk to him. What? What? Yeah, see, he's, he sells all these ores. You can buy them off him. Uh, it's pretty cool. Let's go talk to him. What's going on, man? Or, hi, I'm Clint. He seems pretty shy, so uh, we'll just leave him to his blacksmithing. Alright, let's go further down, see if there's any more people. I think, um, actually let's head up back to the saloon. Ooh, what's this? Uh, this is somebody's house. We're breaking it, we're, we're actually just entering, because uh, we actually didn't break any into anything. Yeah, let's head back up to the saloon. Star drop, drop saloon. There's Gus. Man, he looks kind of drunk. Alright, so there's nobody in here. I mean, why would you get drunk at 12 o'clock? <laughs> that sounds... If you do, that's pretty depressing. I mean, it kind of means you got a problem. Let's talk to, let's talk to her. Hi. Oh, did you want something? A conversation would be nice, I mean. No? Uh, Alright. Let's head down here. A little exploring. Across this bridge. These graphics are actually pretty good for a 8-bit um, game. Fisherman. Uh, we'll go see him in the next let's play. Because I think I'm going to only do day one. Because I think we're at like almost 14 minutes 30 at this point in the let's play. And I really don't want to have it more than about 20 25 minutes. Alright, so let's head over here. Let's see what's over here. Here's where we buy the house upgrades. Of course, she'd have the nicest house in Stardew Valley. I mean, she can just build this shit whenever she wants. Oh, she's not even in here. There's another river down here, so let's go check it out. Fucking hell, where is it? <laughs> here it is. Check out all the oh. If you use your hoe on these worms and just hit them, they give you stuff. Like clay. Oh, there's fucking nobody down here. There's somebody drowning! Help, I'm drowning! Help, I'm drowning! Nah, we're just gonna let him die. Cause I can't swim either. Fuck it. Well, that reminds me of uh, that episode of Spongebob when uh, Spongebob was a lifeguard. That was one of the funniest fucking episodes. Um, Quite frankly, the old ones are better. Oh, who's, who are you? Yeah, hi. Seems pretty shy, so let's just get the hell out of here. Head back up here. Get the sigh out. Hiya! Rate. Get this stick out. Sell all this shit. Come on. Yeah, so it's really, like, shitty at this point, because, uh, I mean, we haven't lived here for 20 years. Well, nobody has. So, we just had some time to shitty up, if that's even a serious. My expert counting skills was wrong, guys. It was, it was mine. I mean, can you really blame me, though? Shit, it was hard to fucking count. Uh, put some strain on your eyes, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, get the hoe out. And put down the parchment piece. Okay, so that's good. Now we have to water these. Get the watering can out. Water, water. Rada, rada, rada. I wonder if you have you guys ever seen the um chowder? That was like, it was an old show on Cartoon Network. It's the, it's the 2008 show, but. It was really funny. <laughs> really fucking funny. 
That was one of my favorite shows when I was uh, growing up. So, yeah. Alright, so we got all the plants watered. And there's actually something else I want to do in this Let's Play. Uh, if we have enough energy. Let's go ahead and go over here. I want to cut down some trees, because let's go into crafting. We can actually open up, um, make a chest, like in Minecraft, to store our items. Because we only have about 10 space, I think. I don't know, I didn't, I didn't count, I just guessed. Howard sucks at guessing. Alright, so let's go ahead and find some trees to chop down. Fucking hell. Alright, let's cut this one down. This large, majestic tree. Pretty glad I chose the lumberjack outfit. Suits the part. But at the same time, we're also a badass cyborg. Gray hair. Wait, it's not gray. That makes it sound like it's old. It's silver. That makes it sound like a badass. Right? No. All right, okay then. It's fine. Alright, we're coming pretty close with this energy. No, we're exhausted. Fuck. <laughs> I blame that grass. If we hadn't have swung with the grass, we would have been completely fine. Alright, let's go to crafting. And we got our first chest. Let's get it in our hands. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. And the first chest is down. <laughs> Alright, let's put all this shit in here that we don't need. And uh, it seems like we've run out of energy, so we can't really do anything else. So I'm going to end the video there. Hopefully you guys will enjoy this series. I personally enjoy playing this game. It's really fun. Um, if you want your friend to enjoy this Let's Play, uh, you could always share it to them on Twitter, Facebook, Insta. It really doesn't matter. Uh, just spreading the word around. Um, go ahead and three-star that like button. If you're a Clash Royale player, go ahead and three-crown it. And I'll see you guys in the next Let's Play. HTDG Gaming out.